You know, I'm absolutely passionate about this topic of temperament. What I'm really even more passionate about is the fact that our school systems, its teachers and its administrators, know virtually nothing about temperament, which means they're not really employing that knowledge in helping our kids learn. It wasn't employed for me. As I grew up, I was a fire. A fire has a really difficult time in the school system. The system is just not made to fit how the fire wants to see the world and how they want to operate in the world. I hated to produce written documents, so I didn't do much homework. I hated to have things done to me that were required by the system. You know, when I, someone told me to do something, basically my head gave them the Italian salute. The school system itself almost largely is all the other temperaments. That means that I was sitting in a classroom the majority of the time that was made up of temperaments that I didn't necessarily understand, if even trust. So I went through life resisting what was in front of me. It's estimated that about 70% of the kids in the school system who are at risk are in that same place. They're in the place of a school system that doesn't know how to teach them. They believe that their way is the right way. They believe that those children, if they just got in line, would be fine. And what we're doing today to a lot of them who are very young, since they act out in the classroom, and since they're nervous, and since they are very engaged in things other than what the teacher wants them to do, they're basically put on Ritalin and drug. Now, I know there's a lot of kids out there that really do have ADD, and I think it does a great disservice to them to lump a high fire person in that same basket with a kid who has ADD. It's estimated about 70% of those kids could get better teaching, could learn, because there's examples of how it can happen. There are school systems today that take fire kids who used to be put into, you know, those special ed programs, those other schools to carve them out of the class so that the academic children won't be disturbed. They're put into a different kind of a school system. That school system is made up of teachers who truly understand temperament, who truly understand how a fire needs to learn and that they do in fact want to learn. And those kids right now when they graduate are going to college. Some of the schools in fact are graduating more kids who go to college than the academic institutions do themselves. I think there's a message there. And I think you could see that message if you went out and joined us reading the book, What Makes You Tick and What Ticks You Off. You'd enjoy it. Whether you were an administrator, a teacher, a student, and I know you'd enjoy it if you're a parent.